there are some people out there that just don't like hot dogs. I don't get it, they exist. They probably won't like this one either. Today I wanna to show you guys some Quare Arctic Salmon Dogs. That's right, I said salmon dogs. I'm gonna show you how I like to do it. A little uh, sour cream sauce, a little pico on top. It's fantastic and delicious. Whether it's lunch or just a fun elevated picnic, salmon dogs really do go a long way. I mean, they're fantastic. They are they might seem a little strange, but if you love salmon, you're gonna love these. I wanna start with pico for these salmon dogs. So what I wanna do is take some fresh vine tomatoes. Now the trick here really is your knife skills. You want these to be a nice small dice, maybe even immense, really, really tiny. Throw all of that into a bowl and this is the base of our pico. Now we're gonna do the same thing with some red onion. Make sure it's nice and thin, tiny. You want almost immense, it's a very small dice. Now we're gonna take a bit of serrano, same thing. We want everything to be the same shape and size. Get rid of the seeds if you don't like the heat, but I do, so I'm keeping them. We're also gonna add some fresh, beautiful lime juice. Uh, kinda just, you gotta have it when you're doing pico. You can't forget the garlic, mince that up and throw it in. And last but not least, you have to have some cilantro. Chop that up, it doesn't have to be super tiny, we, bigger pieces are fine in this. Now let's add a little bit of salt and pepper and some olive oil and give that a mix and our pico is done. Having a solid pico recipe in your repertoire is definitely important. Now I've got my Blackstone preheating, uh, medium, medium high heat. Let's go ahead and throw down just a bit of oil. We don't need a ton, just a bit. Let's let that start heating up a little bit. And we will get to our dogs in just a sec. You know, let's clean up our board. It's nice to stay nice and tidy. All right, now let's get to our sauce. Our sauce is extremely simple. We're gonna go with some sour cream into a bowl. We're gonna add a good bit of lime juice, the juice of one whole lime, a pinch of salt, and some pepper, and some ground chipotle. Uh, so if you don't like the heat, again, you can skip this part, but I like it. Give that a solid mix and your sauce is done. I know some of you may be saying, this seems a little weird. A salmon dog, really? Yes, really. Trust me, when you guys get these, it's, it's unbelievable. It kind of messes with your head a little bit, but it's so delicious. It just makes you happy. Look at these beautiful, beautiful dogs. All right, now we're gonna throw those down onto the griddle. Roll them around a good bit. You want them to get nice and toasty on all sides. What we're looking for is crisping up that texture on the outside, just a little tight skin pop. You'll, you'll notice it when you eat it. It's got that beautiful, beautiful little bite. Be sure to get yourself some large buns because these are large dogs. We're gonna go down with a bit of our sauce first, then add that gorgeous salmon dog, and then our pico over the top. Now, if you want to, you can take a little bit more additional sauce, add a little bit of garnish, and my friends, whew, wow, this is like next level hot dog game. Mm. A little messy, but that's okay. <laughs> whoa, whoa, to all my salmon lovers out there, you gotta check out Quarry Salmon Dogs. Oh my goodness. That pico has just the right amount of brightness, just the right amount of sweet uh, from the lime, a little bit of heat. I love the heat again, you can take it out. I love it, it goes perfect with the salmon. Oh my goodness. Please make these, please make these at home. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love recipes like this. They're simple but loaded with flavor. A Little bit of technique, really good ingredients, elevate your game. Be sure to check out Quarry Arctic Salmon on Amazon or on their website. Be sure to check out Betty's show, CJ's show, Todd's show. Check out Bruce's show, Destination Delicious. We have so many shows on the channel now, so much fun. But this is Cook, Eat, Repeat, where we help you become a better cook, one recipe at a time. I'm your host, Chef Nathan Lippy, and I'm gonna finish, oof, I'm gonna finish both of these.